Let's talk for a minute about a computer speed. So the system clock is the measurement of a computer speed. Like we saw that again when we went to start and clicked on my computer and chose properties. Uh, we saw that the speed of this computer, if we were to say, what's the speed of that computer? We'd say it's 3.4 gigahertz. And that's the measurement of the system clock, right? And when we talk about a computer speed, uh, that's what we're looking for is the clock speed, 3.4 gigahertz. So, you know, that's, that's what people are referring to when they say, how fast does your computer go or how powerful is your computer? Often, you know, just what's the clock speed, the system clock. And for this computer, it'd be 3.4 gigahertz. But there are several factors that affect a computer speed. And uh, the clock speed, you know, is certainly one of those factors, right? Right? So how fast, how fast is the computer able to operate? You know, um, that's one of the factors, and that would be kind of akin to also here, you know, the type of CPU, you know, type of CPU, and how fast is the clock speed. So that's one of the factors that affects the computer speed. But another factor which affects, you know, the computer speed is how much RAM does a computer have. So that's another factor that impacts computer speed. And then also, what kind of graphics card does a computer have? Because we learned what expansion slots were, and we saw when I opened up my computer that I actually had an expansion card in one of the expansion slots. And that expansion card was a graphics card. And it actually has its own processor on it. And so there's two processors in my computer. There's a central processing unit, and then there's another CPU located on the graphics card. And when there's a CPU located on the graphics card, they call it a GPU a graphics processing unit. So uh, my computer has uh, an expansion card, a graphics expansion card in an expansion slot, and on that expansion card, there's a GPU, right, a graphics processing unit. And so that will also speed up a computer because it's able to process graphical information more quickly. And that's a really important factor, a really important thing to have if you're doing video gaming and uh, or, you know, yeah, a lot of graphics processing, video editing, video gaming. You'd like to have a good graphics card and a GPU. Another thing that affects a computer speed is also kind of related to the type of CPU. So we can just sub-bullet those guys there. That makes it a little bit more clear. And also the amount of cache that is in uh, the CPU, um, you know, and just maybe outside the CPU. So that affects computer speed. And then the buses. Buses are limited to you know how many zeros and ones can be carried on a bus uh, and uh, so the more that can be carried on a bus the better and how fast can they be carried and also the word size how many zeros and ones can the CPU handle at one time so we could drop that up here too right how many zeros and ones can the CPU handle at one time so these are all factors that affect the computer speed uh, likewise uh, you know a solid state drive over a hard disk drive, a solid state drive is going to be much quicker. So a computer with a solid state drive can boot up in like less than 10 seconds, whereas with a hard disk drive, sometimes it can take 30 seconds or more. So uh, these are some of the factor, factors that affect a computer speed. Uh, and we're going to learn in one of the next videos uh, this week how to speed up a computer regardless of uh, what kind of computer you have, what steps can we take to kind of tweak things a little bit to help it go as quickly as possible. So I call that decrapifying my computer, and we're going to see that in a video here very shortly. But I just wanted to sort of lay out some of the main factors that influence a computer speed so that you can understand it. Uh, you know, like, okay, what determines a computer speed? The amount of RAM, solid state drive, the type of CPU, what kind of clock speeds it's running at, how much cache does it have, what's its word size. You know, these are the factors that affect the computer speed. And generally speaking, when you're in the marketplace looking for a computer, the more you pay for a computer, the faster it's going to go. And so these components, they'll just have better components of everything if you pay, pay more money for it. You'll have more RAM, you'll have a better CPU that's faster, that has, you know, more cash. And, you know, it'll come with a graphics card. And uh, it'll have a really great motherboard with really fast buses on it and you'll have a solid state drive. So if you pay a lot of money, you'll get all the components to make your computer fast. But these are the factors that affect computer speed, and I wanted to differentiate that between, uh, I wanted to differentiate that from, uh, when we talk about a computer speed, generally speaking, we're just saying, hey, what's the megahertz or gigahertz? What's the gigahertz? What's the system clock? You know, how fast does, uh, what's the clock speed? The processor's speed. So that's what we're talking about when we say, what's a computer speed? 
but there are many factors that affect a computer's speed. <laughs> so I just wanted to kind of like show you what those were.